Hey guys, so I was going through my YouTube recommended list and I saw this one video that I initially thought was going to make me drink my dog's piss so I can go into a coma. I'm happy to announce that I did watch the video and I did drink my dog's piss and I did go into a coma. I am a survivor. Now, this video is a plot straight out of Pornhub if the genders were switched. Um, I literally see it right now. The casting couch is waiting. Um, but anyways, we're gonna watch this video, okay? We're gonna watch it together because I can't go into another coma. Hey, Barbie. Yeah, honey. Aren't you excited? Well, I was hoping to get a... PlayStation 5? Oh my god. I can't believe it. Oh, we know how badly you wanted it. Can we be a little realistic here? No parents is going to look at both kids and one kid they're going to give a $500 PlayStation 5 which is harder to find than gold and then the other kid they're going to give a dollar store fucking doll. That is just not realistic. <laughs> but that's what I wanted. Does it come with two controllers? <laughs> Don't be silly Sam. Video games aren't for girls. That's not true. My favorite YouTuber, Sniper Wolf. She started gaming when she was just seven years old. It's my dream to be a gamer. Just like her. Sniper Wolf, what kind of name is that? This is what you should be playing with. Zach, let me help you set that up. Let's go. Thank you so much, Mom and Dad. So the mom just pretty much destroyed her dreams and the dad, instead of saying anything, just sat there and is going to help his son set up the PS5. I guess get good kid, um, the mom is literally shitting on your dreams. Do something about it. Sniper on the roof. Drop an airstrike. Hey! What are you doing playing on my PS5? Give me my controller back! Hold on, there's only six people up. He's low health. Down him. I don't know who she downed. She missed every single shot. And honestly, quite frankly, your mom's right. The gaming isn't for you. Give me that. Wait. Mom! Mom! What's going on? This guy is the definition of a pussy. He can't snatch a controller from his little sister. What a joke if I was the dad. Actually, you know what? Uh, now it makes sense because the dad is just as much of a pussy. Sam took my PS5 and she won't give me back my controller. Sam, I told you video games aren't for girls. Give him back his controller right now. But I'm about to win. Fine. Let's see. <sighs> Man. See? I told you video games aren't for girls. You're trash, kid. Get good. You were using a shotgun to kill someone that's on top of the roof. Even I know that's stupid and I don't even play Warzone. Honestly, your mom might be right here, you know? There's other careers out there. I better not see you playing anymore. Here you go, Zach. Oh, how cute is this? You can wear it when you go back to school. I don't like dresses. Imagine your parents get you uh, something new and you said, I don't want this or I don't like this. You ungrateful piece of... Actually, do you think you can get this new wolf pack hoodie? Please, please. Sniper Wolf just came out with it. That gamer girl? I already told you, video games aren't for girls, so forget about it. But mom, please, it's my dream to become a... Not another word, young lady. Now, I've got to get the rest of these bags, so you can play with this while you wait here. Imagine telling people that your hoodie is actually called the Wolfpack Hoodie. That is a formula to get bullied in school. And on top of that, you're telling your mom to waste 50 to $60 on this merchandise that's going to be irrelevant in the next month because she's going to come up with something else. Gosh, I'm so sorry. Hold on. Don't do do not tell me that sniper wolf. Do not tell me that. There's no way, right? There's no way. That's okay. 
why'd you kick this? I was just mad because I want to be a girl gamer. But my mom says girls can't play. Oh my god! Sniper Wolf? Hi! So, your mom says girls can't what? I have seen better scenarios on fake taxi, uh, casting couch, uh, my fucked up family. Sorry, I'm freaking out right now. I can't believe it's you. Okay. My mom says girls can't play video games. She wants me to play with Barbies instead. That sucks. But honestly, I was always told the same thing growing up. You were? Yeah. But I never let that stop me. If boys can do something, then so can girls. There's no reason why girls can't be gamers. You're so right. I can be a girl gamer. But... What's wrong? I don't have a system. And my brother won't let me play with his. I'll tell you what. You can have the one I just bought. <laughs> what? Really? So she just happens to be walking with a PS5 that, you know, she's just going to hand out. Keep in mind, people have literally killed people for the PS5, and I wish that was a joke. And she's just going to hand that out to a random person she's never met who says she wants to be a gamer girl. Think about that. Just promise me that you'll never give up. And by the way, it's just gamer. What do you mean? You don't call guys boy gamers, right? So no need to say girl gamers, it's just gamer. Well. Boo hoo, you're really out here changing the world, okay? Because that it's so offensive to say gamer girl, which keep in mind, girls created, okay? It, it wasn't, it, it was created by ethos. That whole word was created by ethos so they can get OnlyFans sales. I never thought about it that way. Thanks, Cyber Wolf. I'll never forget this. I hope to see you at the top one day. I gotta move. The circle's closing. And Papa knew UAV. Sam, what are you doing? You know how I feel about this. Just wait, Mom. I'm about to win. Oh, here we go again. How many times do I have to tell you girls can't play video games? I don't even know how you got one, but after you lose, I'm taking away your PlayStation. So you're telling me she didn't notice a giant box the size of a TV, okay, in the back of her car. And how did she get that in the house without her noticing? If that was me, I'm, I'm thinking that my daughter just hit the nastiest lick of all time. Yes, got him. There's only one person left. There he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got him! Yes! Yes! Yes, I won! Really? <laughs> if winning a game of Warzone all was all it took to make it as a gamer, then I would have made it in the eSports League when Fortnite was a thing because I got around 500 wins in a very short time. But guess what? The minute I faced a pro player, I got curb stomped into the ground. I was eating dirt because that's how much of a fucking difference there is between a regular person and a pro person. Hey, what happened? I just won Warzone. What? You're kidding. <laughs> I've never won before. Do you think you could help teach me? <laughs> yeah, sure. Come here. Sir, you are a pussy. How the fuck have you not won a single game of Warzone? That that has to be one of the easiest battle royals. If you don't have a brain cell, you go to Warzone. It is just that much easier. You just hide. And the fact that you want to know how to play Warzone, you aim, you shoot if you see somebody, and then you run. That that's that's all it is. You literally hide in Warzone and you shoot. That that's all 99% of the people do. And it's it's not very hard. That's every battle royale ever. The mom can't believe that Sam just won. If getting a win in Warzone was all it took for her to convince herself that she can become an esports fucking player, then we got bigger problems. And as time goes on, Sam starts to win more and more. 
the mom starts to realize that maybe girls can be gamers. A while later, Sam even gets offered. Listen, if winning Warzone was all it took to become an esports uh, league member, whatever they're called, um, I hate to break it to you, but those guys literally piss in the lemonade cup they just drank and they play 20 hours a day for them to be really good at their art because getting good at a video game at that high of a level takes a lot of time and a lot of effort, not just a couple wins of Warzone. An official spot on a popular esports team. That letter said Waze Clan. Why can't you just say FaZe? Who cares? They're not going to sponsor you. Just, just say FaZe. That happens to also include a big advance payment. Her family couldn't be any more proud of her. And then one day, Sam even starts streaming. Hey guys, thanks for joining me. And today's live stream, I've actually got my mom joining me. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm Sam's mom and- It's Psychomantis. What? That's my gamer name. I am so proud of Psychomantis and- If my kid ever tells me to call him or her by her gamer tag or her gamer name, you're going straight to boarding school. The first thing I'm doing is getting you a ticket to the nearest adoption center. She showed me that girl gamers can be really successful. Thanks, Mom. And no need to say girl gamer. It's just gamer. Okay, guys, we're about to hop in in Warzone, but before we get into that, I just want to say we're about to hit our 5K sub goal, and I just want to say if that helps. Please excuse me, I'm gonna go eat some crayons until I shit rainbow. Anyways, if you want to watch a 40 year old virgin, going on his first date. I put the video up right here. Here's a feminist explaining why the word man is sexist. And you know, on top of that, here's a man having sex with his car. It's very pretty.